Welcome to my channel. It's October 1st. Well, I mean, it is October 1st when I posted this, at least. And Madam Glam has a new collection, and this is their um, fall collection. Look at the beautiful fall colors. Uh, Madam Glam, thank you so much for sending these for me to share with everyone. I just love fall like everyone does. I don't know anybody that hates fall. They did send me this collection. This collection is called Rock, Paper, Scissors, and it's loosely based on Edward Scissorhands. So some of the names kind of coincide with the movie, and I think that's kind of cool. I love that they have a theme that we can kind of work with and do with nail art and stuff. So, like usual, I'm not really going to spend a whole lot of time swatching these polishes for you. I am going to show them all to you and show you swatching the first coat and maybe make a few comments. But I do have a 30% off discount code and it is just Gylene30. Um, if you are not a VIP member and there's something super exciting out there right now, I won't mention it, but they are sending it to me. To show you that um, something that only VIPs can access to so that's an, an incentive if you do buy gels quite often I absolutely recommend doing the VIP you get 50% off I am a member I do pay $30 a month and that $30 a month goes into my account and I use that to purchase any gels I want anything I want on their site 50% off all right, so as always, they are vegan, cruelty-free, 21-free, HEMA-free, and palm oil-free. All right, let's do a swatch of these. I am going to spend a little bit more time showing you some artwork and some options to use gels. Um, these in particular, they are gorgeous. There are three that are kind of shimmery, and it's really cool. All right. Stay tuned and I'm going to show you one coat and then I'm just going to show you all of them with two coats and a top coat.
are the three that have just a little bit of micro glitter in them. Um, Fantasy, which is this beautiful deep pink. Focus. So pretty. I mean, it's not like something you're going to see from across the room, but close up, they are absolutely beautiful. And Play Dead also has this beautiful, just uh, very fine micro glitter. And then the Inventor also. Did I, I spelled that wrong? What a moron. <laughs> that one also has just a little bit of micro glitter. Those are gorgeous. Again, these have two coats and a top coat. Cold lips. They all are awesome with two coats. No angel. Um, this is a little bit peach leaning. That one is definitely just like a sage green. Spooky pants, oh my God. It is a toffee, beautiful, beautiful toffee. Scream. This is what my daughter has on her nails right now and I will put a picture of what I did on her. Love this color too. Foggy night. Um, I'm sure that it's coming across on camera a little darker than it actually is. I've got lotion all on my fingers. I'm goobering these up. This one is a perfect forest green. These are just awesome fall colors. This is mysterious. It is like definitely a um, khaki green and witch's night beautiful purple dark purple perfect rich witchy witchy color this one looks just awesome with pretty much anything um all right i'm gonna figure out what the heck i'm gonna do um i just don't know but we're gonna do some artwork and i have some fun um water decals that I'm going to use that are Edward Scissorhands. Man, I have some gears I think that I'll use and some scissors and I don't know, like, like, look, I've got scissors. I just got all kinds of fun stuff I think of that I can incorporate in Edward Scissorhands. Okay, these are the color combinations that I decided to go with. These five colors beautiful and um, those five together and then i i feel like these five i think would make a beautiful um gradient also these five would look fabulous together too um but you know i, I like them all i'm just trying to figure out what goes with what and I had a really hard time deciding, but I do have some pinks coming up for um, October that I'm gonna be showing you. And I don't know, those might be worked in too. So these are the five that I decided to go with. And they are so beautiful together. Um, but you can kind of see the sparkle in that one. Very, very pretty. I kind of wish they all had this shimmer in them, but because I don't have, I mean, I kind of have some colors similar to this, to these, but not with the shimmer and the shimmer is so gorgeous. All right, so I am going to start with a little bit of water on this palette. And on the kind of mustardy, yellow gold color. I'm going to put these scissors in a copper. Kind of like just some background. And the copper is hit the bottle. Copper haired girl. Love that color. 
And on the same Embrace the Dark Side Hit the Bottle plate, there is these stitches. Snitches get stitches. And I just want to put a couple of those on this one. And then when I decide what else I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and with that little bit of water, put these decals um, on the water and let them sit there for a minute. I think the instructions say like to drop them in a bottle of water for 60 seconds, but I don't like that. <laughs> I'm just going to put them on this. I'm gonna few put a few of these gears. In gold, this this is Calypso gold. I love this gold. Also from Hit the Bottle. I think put that on here. Yeah, this is definitely needs to be matte, I think. I got way carried away with water on this, so I am going to soak up a little bit of this water. Okay. Let's move that one over there. And then I'm just going to take a stamper and pick him up. Oh, I hate that. Okay. These, you have to like really cut out well and I didn't. That's all right. I'll trim it off later, I guess. Oh, that is not sticking at all. Okay, I got these from Etsy and I'm not a fan of the water decals that you have to trim way down. All right, though, that's sticking pretty good. I will have to trim that though. All right, I'm going to go ahead and clean this up. And top coat and then be right back. Okay, there's a little bear all trimmed up. Okay, there they are with a shiny top coat. Really pretty. I love that gold over the green and the copper over the orange. There's that. Uh, gold and bronze just look amazing over these colors. And um, so that was kind of Ginger's idea. And absolutely go check out Ginger's channel if you aren't already subscribed and you don't already watch her uh, Madam Glam reviews because she compares them with all the Madam Glam colors that she already has so that you're not getting any dupes. And I think that she found a couple of dupes. I found a couple of dupes in my stash. So be sure and watch her channel. Um, watch her review of the polishes because she always does dupe videos and let's check it out with some matte and there we have it all in matte um I don't really like this one matte I do like this one matte um, I think that color would look pretty matte 
this is gorgeous matte that not so much so and um, that looks great matte i i don't think i like it matte with the artwork i did i think i like it better shiny but i want to point out that anytime you're going to do a matte and you're stamping please make sure and do a shiny top coat first because um, matte will smear your stamping even with gel it will smear your stamping so I don't really like this Manny that well um, matte I loved it shiny so I am gonna make it shiny and for pictures and I guess that's all I have for you today and I thank you so much for joining me these are gonna get used so much this season they are absolutely gorgeous I love them all and Okay, that's all I have for you today. Uh, please stay tuned. Um, I, I feel like I need to explain this a little bit. The uh, bandage around my grandson's head is because he was jumping on the bed. And he fell off and bonked his head. And he told me I needed to call the doctor. <laughs> and that he needed a bandage wrapped all the way around his head. So and once he quit crying, we went in search of a bandage. <laughs> He just trotted along behind me telling me he needed a bandage. So um, this little bit of clip is just after his mom came to pick him up and she had a nail that needed repaired. And I actually had this scream on her nails. And I also had a sparkly pink that I showed you last week. It's not out here right now, so I don't remember it. But anyway, um, that is what else is on her nails. And I will put a picture up here. Of the mani that we did but she had lost one of her 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 nails and i had to repair it and so he helped me get ready and fix it and and um he cracks me up easy don't push hard there you go her knee pink i know i know her knee's pink but we had to put we have to put clear on there first we had to put base coat on there first okay okay so tell her to cure it now put it in there mom Okay, we're using Scream. It's new and shouldn't be shown yet. Scream. Can you say what color it is? Black! <laughs> it's pink. Uh huh, uh huh. It's pink. Okay. It's done. Is it done? It's done. It's done. <laughs> Okay, we gotta paint, put pink on there. Mm -hmm. Okay. I have you. Okay, you help me. It is. Good. Be really careful with this color. Pour inside. Okay, hold on. Okay, hold on. Okay. Okay, she can put it inside. <laughs> Okay. <laughs>